Hello everybody, and welcome to a special off-the-stream dinosaur video. As you can see, we still have our ugly orange house, but I've done a little bit. I uh, checked the map while I was caving, I found a spider spawner underground, so we're going to check that out at the end of this video. Um, I haven't done it, I'm going to make a spawner out of it, make a farm out of it. Um, we got some wheat, carrots, and potatoes. I'm eating some carrots. Oh, there's some cows growing over there, and there's some cactus growing right there. And then, but this, this is our smeltery. And so what I wanted to bring you guys to see in this video is the smeltery itself. I made some casts, which, so you make stencils, and you use the stencils to make regular, um, I threw out the other things that I already made the casts of, regular, like, stone or wood parts. Then you cast the parts using gold, and I need to go find more gold. And then, like, here's the part builder, there's the stencil table, and then here's the tool forge. And so we're going to make ourselves, starting off, a pickaxe. What we're going to do in this video, we're going to make ourselves a pickaxe. Then off camera, I'm going to go myself, make myself a hammer, a hatchet, a shovel, and I'm going to wait on a sword, because we're going to go to the nether for that. Well, I'm probably going to go to the nether off camera, too. But yeah, so we're going to make lots of tinkers tools. Um, I made some alumite, which is one part obsidian, one part iron, and two parts aluminum. I'm not really sure. And then there's some bronze in here, which is just copper and tin. And so we're going to make an alumite head and an alumite, well, you know what? Mm. I want to see this. Handle modifier 1.3. Reinforce 2. So we're going to make the entire pick out of Alumite. We're not going to mix and match right now. Until we can get some a little better. Yeah. Okay. So let's go right here. And we'll go... Boop, boop, boop. Only my pick. We can name it. Let's name it... Pinky. Because it's pink. Okay, and now we can add some modifiers. And I have this already all cooked up. I made a ball moss using my chisel here. I turned some regular stone into mossy stone bricks. Nine mossy stone bricks in a block formation will give you a ball moss which makes tool Tinker's tools have auto repair. So we got auto repair. We have diamond, which adds 500 durability and ups. Wait, do I really need to do that? Eh, 500 durability is good. Yeah, because we have no emeralds. And now we're going to make... We're going to put some redstone on it. Oopsie. Alright, now we have haste, which makes it mine faster. It's like efficiency. And eventually we can put things like luck and such on it. Okay, so now we're going to go down. Actually, we're just going to teleport, because I left a couple things in here. So here's our cave spider spawner. Um, yeah, I came from that way. Oh, and I can mine up all this reef resources I skipped over. And there's still more cave that way. I just saw, literally the cobble sticking out and I immediately knew I haven't been here so this is spawner I think a spider just spawned up there but in this chest I took everything out but three dragon eggs now thanks to dragon mounts a very fun exciting mod we can hatch our own various dragons to ride on and enjoy and that becomes my main mode of transportation and so we can finally fly up to those cliffs, and we can look at our beautiful, what will be a beautiful park from the sky. And so that's all I wanted to show you guys. This has been an off-the-stream special recording of our Dinosaur Mon Pack. Check me out when I live stream on Twitch TV back, uh, slash SquatchyLP, same as my YouTube username. 
and eventually I'll be posting more videos on YouTube, more like actual episodes. But for right now, it's mostly streaming.